And if LeBron James would just get to the free throw line, go to the hoop, he can change the tenor of this game. Oh, James hit the back of his head on the floor as he went up to try to knock the ball away from Josh Howard. And he is shaken up. The uh, force of the hit you can see right away. And we'll get a timeout. The back of James' head did hit the court immediately. And he had nothing to break his fall. So uh, we'll take a peek as we step out here for a minute. As James went up, he lost his balance. And then the back of his head will come crashing down on the floor. So the uh, athletic trainer, Max Benton, along with the Cavs medical staff, have to check on LeBron. And we'll step out here for a second. Welcome back to Cleveland. Just before we left, we saw LeBron James hit the back of his head on the floor right here. He is in the huddle right now. He will continue in the game. He took a hard fall, according to Max Benton, on his head. LeBron looked over at me, gave me the thumbs up. He will continue. He is flexing his jaw and the back of his neck. I think it just kind of shook him up quite a bit. It was an awful hard fall, but he is going to continue in the game, guys. All right, let's take a peek at that fall and listen to the violence with which the back of his head hits the court. Sounds like it hurts even more when you see it happen there. And then LeBron, after staying down for some 45 seconds, getting up. And a nice reception here. And the very durable LeBron James, who only missed 11 games here.